guys. Hey, nice to meet you. Welcome, guys. First of all, welcome to Arizona. How you guys doing? Great! We're gonna have some fun today. Um, so, for those of you who maybe aren't huge baseball fans, this is where the Padres come to get ready for the season. So luckily for us, pretty close to home, right? I know you guys flew out here yesterday. And uh, everything the team could ever need is here. Um, you know, from batting practice areas, to places for the pitchers to throw, to an unbelievable weight room, and everything else. So this is kind of like home away from home for about six weeks before the season starts. It's a wonderful facility, and uh, as I said, we're really lucky to be able to be here. So thrilled, thrilled to have you guys. We're gonna have some fun. I'm gonna show you everything that I'm allowed to show you. I will take you out to the fields. We'll meet some players. We're gonna we're gonna have what I hope is like a really special day for you guys. If you have any questions about baseball or the building or anything else, hit me, and uh, I'll either let you know the answer or I'll make something up that sounds pretty cool. <laughs> so we'll have some fun. Again, my name is Jesse. So great to meet you all. And uh, let's head inside. Hey, Come on. Jesse. players look a little bit more like most of us, uh, but they still work out like crazy. You'll even see guys after a game, uh, we could be on the road and they're lifting heavy weights after the game, getting themselves, you know, as physically ready as they can be. I think in this sport, you know, probably 20 years ago or so, that started to change a little bit and now it's like a, a really, really big part of what they do. So we'll go check out the weight room. If you're into weights, if you're into fitness, that kind of stuff, this is, uh, this is pretty extraordinary, the, the amount of gear they have in there. So come on down, let's check it out. down uh, towards the stairs and you see there's some batting practice taking place on the field. It's pretty cool. I mean, as a fan, right, you'll see a bunch of fans are kind of lined up over there. We'll head that way soon. These guys are just walking right past you. I mean, at a game at Petco, right, or on the road, usually it's hard to get kind of close. Uh, but here at spring training, it's incredibly intimate. So if you're you know, trying to get an autograph or a picture with somebody, I always tell fans this is the best time of year to try and do it. Uh, it's amazing how close everybody can really get. And obviously we're gonna get even closer than, than they're doing. So like I said, this is field one. They got batting practice going on. The stadium is over there. That's where the game is gonna be this afternoon. We'll walk over there at the end. Let's go take a closer look. more than the games, it's about getting ready for the season to start. And so all this work that happens on these backfields, we call them, these practice fields, it's so cool. Yes. Oh, here's Tim, I was glad. Yay. Tim Hill, everybody. Yay. I was just giving them the, uh, you know, the short version of your story. You know, just like y'all, I, I dealt with the same, similar things that y'all dealt with. Um, in 2015, I had colon, stage three colon cancer. Um, and for me, it was like, you know, baseball kind of saved my life and that it was spring training that um, allowed it to be found. So, you know, normally I don't think I would have gotten the test that, that I would have gotten and the blood work was just off, so they found it and it's just really thankful that we had that testing and whatnot. I think you guys are really brave and I think you guys are awesome for being able to go through what you guys go through and just keep waking up every day, have a positive attitude and it makes a huge difference. Bob Melton, man. A guy who uh, is probably not going to have any trouble with Justin Taylor in the world. Oh, I love him. What's going on, guys? This is Manny Machado. You guys doing good? Yeah, yeah. All right, so this is the stadium. This is where the game will be taking place. Uh, it'll start less than an hour from now. Steve Jennings, Chief External Affairs Officer at Rady Children's Hospital. Partnership between Rady Children's Hospital in San Diego and the Padres, spring training, and we brought 12 of our cancer patients from the hospital to spend the weekend at spring training. 
You sign it, I sign it, and uh, you are officially Padres, and uh, you are going to be welcomed in as a part of our organization this weekend, and thank you for spending time with us this weekend. We're so excited to do that with you guys. So with that, Steve, I'll bring you back up, and uh, let's sign some contracts. Players came out when we were at the complex today to see the Padres game, hung out with the kids, chatted, signed baseball, signed jerseys, including Manny Machado, which was pretty, the kids got real excited about that. But it was really special. And then tonight, a number of the Padres came and had dinner with us. We had a little bit of a uh, taco party and we got to play video games here at Dave & Buster's. It's been pretty, pretty amazing. Great to see these kids when they first get together. They don't know each other necessarily. So these are 12 strangers to each other. They're all going through a similar experience right now. And the first 12 hours or so, they're all kind of shy. By the next morning, they're best friends, they're laughing, they're walking around, arms around each other. It's really, really special to see these kids that are cancer patients every day, they just get to be kids for the weekend, and that's really special.